What's up everybody, Supreme Decisions here. And yes, today I have a little nugget for you. Because you know I like clarity whenever we're doing this. Unlike doing this next to a truck stop, I'm gonna offer you an opportunity even with using the Smooth X gimbal to keep the frames level, not all the bouncy bounce while I'm walking and talking. But today I wanna talk about he said, she said. And a couple of things that most people really don't grasp. Now, oftentimes you'll hear me talk about police officers and their ability to arrest. Well, one of the things I want to talk to you about is when you're out, you have an officer show up on the scene. And prior to talking to anybody, they immediately place someone in handcuffs. After that, they go to tell you different things and don't read you your Miranda rights. Or, and the circle begins. Well, as we know, when a police officer comes on the scene, one, one of the things I actually like to pull up is the fact that they need probable cause not only to arrest, but they also need probable cause to support the statement that has been made by the call, which is why I'm going to put that up over here. A caller needs more than just a description for police officers to arrest. Why? Because the police officers actually need probable cause to arrest. And along with that, subjecting someone to felonious conditions by doing things such as placing them in handcuffs, telling them to sit down over here. Those are called show of authority stops. That too is illegal without probable cause. Because again, they need something that not only supports what's being said to them by the complainant, which would be probable cause, they also need something for the most of most effect of it is that will contradict what you're saying, which is why they're not allowed to use a hunch or guess. And that's why things such as I don't know do not qualify for a warrant. They need either your consent to participate or they need consent from a judge to arrest, which is why because of here, they're not allowed to make a decision based on what probable cause is or isn't without a judge who is more qualified. Keep that in mind. This is why I say challenge every aspect of the arrest. Challenge every aspect of the encounter. And don't worry about all this other noise because Supreme is going to get you clarity. And right now, you know what to do. Keep supporting. Love you. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep growing. And Supreme, out. Out.